Hello, my nerd musician friends. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can finally, finally, finally connect an external mic, like a lavalier mic or a Rode Video Micro, straight to your MacBook Pro, okay? So let's get started. So if you're like me, you probably have been wondering, wow, why it's so hard, I need a microphone, like a condenser mic and an audio interface and then use the USB or get like a USB preamp or whatever. Why it's so hard to just get a mic and connect to your MacBook Pro? So first of all, our MacBook Pro doesn't have a microphone input, it just has a phone jack, right? So how we are supposed to use our microphone in a headphone jack. The thing is, is that the MacBook Pro just has one phone output, right? One phone jack. However, it has the capability of being a microphone jack too. But let's see what happens if you just connect a microphone to this input. So I'm going to open here my sound preferences. And if you see in your intern, in your input, in your internal microphone, this is built in or it means that we are using the MacBook Pro built-in mic. And if we just connect our lavalier mic, nothing happens. It's still considered, a, it's still using the built-in mic. So after some time researching, I discovered that there is one magic trick, one little gadget that's going to make all of this work, which is the headphone jack splitter. So this magical splitter is intended to split your headphone output into headphone and microphone. So you expect if you just connect a microphone and the headphone in the splitter, things will just work, right? Let's take a look. So I have my splitter here, right? And I'm going to connect to this input and now this has, um, one has the mic uh, icon here and the other one has the phone. So you know where to connect. So I'll get my Lavalier mic and connect to my microphone. And bam, oh, it doesn't work. Mm, okay, so let's connect this to the splitter too. Right? It should work. And everything is connected and nothing. At this point, you are, damn it, I just spent some money here because people say, some people say that it works, some people say that it doesn't work. And yeah, this splitter is broken. I'm just going to return and get my money back. However, I got you covered. There's one final trick. This headphone jack here expects a certain amount of input. So for example, this thing here has the tip, ring, ring, sleeve. So it's T R R S. And my phones here are the same way. Tip R R S. However, which I believe this thing here expects a certain number that's not being uh, found with this uh, combination. So what I did, I got this small adapter here which can get an input and an output with TRS. So I'm going to connect my microphone into this and now I'm going to connect my microphone here to the mic in and my phones here to my uh, headphone out and Let's connect this, uh, let's disconnect and connect this again to see what happens. BAM! And now we have microphone port here. You see that things changed. So the only thing I had to do was making sure that my phone, my, uh, for example, my iPhone, phone or any phone you have is just 
TRS, not TRRS. And now, if we open any software that we want to record, like Ableton Live, and if we just select our normal built in mic, let's start recording. So instead of recording the built in mic, now it's recording the, the level ear mic. So that's it guys, that's all you need. You need this adapter, I'm going to leave the link below so you can buy it. And you need that like final trick to make sure that your TRS, TS, TRS are all right, okay? So I hope you find this video useful. This trick was really useful to me. So give a like to this video if you liked and subscribe if you didn't do yet. This channel is mainly focused on building things on like for example MIDI controllers and if you are into that I have this free course down here where I teach you how you can start building your own stuff which is going to increase your awareness of possibilities of making in the music tech world and it's just really nice, okay? So see you next time.